Okay, we have the 9 RLT. Got the test ride this yesterday. This is a custom build up frame set. Uh, we've got a SRAM CX1 groups, and it works really good. The brakes work good. I would put a smaller chain ring on the front, maybe a 32, 34 or 32 on the front. Uh, this bike has got the light bike Chinese carbon rims, which is getting a really good review online. It comes with the Rebay 32 mil tires, so 24 mil, 24 mil internal rivets, so it really pumps that tire to almost like a 40C. We have band clamp derail option. We've got the carbon fork, full carbon fork. We've got a dynamo hub on there. It's the Niner fork, which is looks pretty good. Looks like it's ready for bottle mats. It's ready for fenders. This bike was recently ridden from Bangkok to Chiang Mai, so it's getting done. It's getting used well. Uh, that was a cobble gobber specialized saddle and uh, seat post there. 27.2. This is the Cycle 2 Charge Dot DE. They're a pretty cheap little, uh, but quality little uh, thing. It's a 40 cassette on this Bianchi. 40 cassette quark on the Bianchi. Leave your comments, questions down below. How did the RLT alloy version run? It rode really good. I was like, wow, this bike, it feels fast. It feels like I could do a sub, probably a sub 31 minute up Doisa tap. You know, I'm a TCR, but maybe sub 30. So it, it felt very, very fast, very, very capable. Is If you're pretty hard on your bike, so, and you keep your bikes a long time, then the nine and a warranty may be a little bit short for you. So check with the warranty how long that is for you in your country. In Australia, nine doesn't have much support. So if you do break a frame, you can be really stranded at the moment because I think there's no distributor in Australia. But the bike did ride very nice. For the frame, it is pretty axy for a bike that has a low warranty, but the ride quality did feel good. So it's up to you what you think. But I rode the bike, I liked it, would I buy one? If it came in fluid or yellow, maybe, but the warranty was a little bit issue, and I do break frames from usage. So, yes, that's there's good. You've got to understand what sort of riding you do, how long you stick, keep your stuff for, basic value menu. If you crack it, it's probably going to be going in the bin. Recycling bin, of course. There you go, you've got to comment some questions about the Niner. RLT Alloy, hit me up down below. Easy. It's gone too far. It's time to wipe the fake blood off that platinum plate.